Creating one segment is typical when you want to trim the beginning and ending of a file to create an exact file duration for use in a playlist. Select the file you want to trim by clicking once on the file in the file browser. It will queue to the first frame. Notice that the file shows no segment brackets when displayed in the file browser. Click the Segment button or just double-click the file to open the segment drop-down. Notice that the clip now shows brackets around the clip name in the file browser. The file length hasn't changed, but the brackets indicate you have created a new, untrimmed segment. Use the motion controls to view the clip. You can single step forward and backward using the step buttons or use the left and right arrow keys on the keyboard which also provide half speed play in forward or reverse when continually held down. Use the mark in and mark out buttons or the I and O shortcut keys on the keyboard to set the trim points. If you like NLE style clip trimming you can also drag the left and right brackets to set your corresponding in and out marks. The brackets turn yellow when they're active. You can also enter a timecode value in both the in and out fields. The respective in and out mark will snap to that timecode position as you enter the number. Once you've entered an in and out mark, the Save button is highlighted, reminding you to save your work. Notice that in the file browser, the clip duration between the brackets has changed, indicating you have created one shorter trimmed segment. The displayed time is segment duration, not the original file duration. At any time before you click Save, you can click Cancel. The segment dropdown will close, and the brackets around the file name in the file browser will disappear.